Hi guys, it's Mari, and I'm participating today in the Crafty Maven Getaway channel um, crop, and that online crop is happening over on our YouTube channel if you want to check it out. And I'm hoping to get this video up today, September 19th. If I don't, the crop is actually happening for over the course of a week. You can enter the challenges and so on, and that's in conjunction with the Crafty Maven Getaway destination group on Facebook. So um, if you want to participate, um, you should do that. It's a lot of fun. So today I'm just working on a layout um, in this video in response to Rachel Reynolds challenge, which is to use some Project Life cards on your layout. And I don't do that very often. So I kind of just hopped right on board onto that one. And I'm doing a grid layout today here using kind of a combination of some Create Paper Poolside and Journey and some Simple Story Summer Vibes collection. So um, I'm just, yeah, this grid design that I'm using comes together very, very quickly. And that's a nice thing about a grid design. And when you're using a grid design, it's really, really easy to incorporate Project Life cards. So I am actually doing my best right now to use up as much of my hip kits as I can. And that was part also of my um, purpose here today with this layout is to use up a bunch of that stuff that I have in my craft room. My uh, video today is also in celebration of the Thousand Subbies contest that I've been holding over the last couple of weeks, which was finished a couple days ago. And it's been a really busy week for me at work, so I'm just now getting around to um, announcing the winners for that. So there were going to be, and there are two winners for that contest, um, each winning a $25 gift card to scrapbook.com. And uh, the one winner was the most engaged and that I used my YouTube analytics for. So I went on to my analytics and I um, went into my, uh, I think it's uh, community and then you can go into fans and it tells you who the most engaged person is. And um, I suspect that they sort that out by figuring out how many minutes that person has watched of your, your videos. So the most engaged person, according to the YouTube analytics, is, drum roll, Lisa Kingston. So I want to thank Lisa so much for uh, going through my videos and spending a lot of time watching them and all of the comments that you made on those videos that you watched. Wow, over the last couple of weeks, I can't even tell you how many uh, comments Lisa has left on the I don't know how many videos I have on my YouTube channel, maybe 50 or something like that. I don't, I don't know. That's just, I'm guessing, but, um, thanks so much, Lisa. I really, really appreciate your support. And for everyone else that entered the contest and has been watching, I just can't even express to you how much that means to me. It's, it's, uh, it's just a really nice feeling to know that people are interested in watching stuff that you love to do. So thanks so much. The other contest winner was a random number generator and I randomly generated the number 27 and the number 27 landed on the comment by Carol Johnson. And so Carol Johnson, you are the second winner and I want to thank you so much as well, Carol, for all of your kind comments and for uh, participating in the contest. So if you guys could personal message me, you could do that on Facebook. On Facebook, I'm Mari Lee Clark and that's L-E-E. -E. So just my name with an L-E-E -E is a middle name. Um, and you could, or you could uh, just message me on YouTube as well. And I will um, send you, I will send scrapbook.com your email and they will send you the code for your gift card. So that's very simple and easy and congratulations. And thanks again so very, very much. I really appreciate it. So um, onward and upward with this layout, you can see that I've just been working away on um, sticking stuff down and taking um, just really, basic stuff, those, the chipboard sheet from the poolside collection, I just basically am trying to use that up. So I'm just throwing down as many of those chipboard pieces as I can on this layout. And I'm using some other little bits and pieces from poolside as well, like those, the sun and fun ephemera pieces from the kit, from the hip kit. 
And uh, yeah, that's, this is just a really, really simple little layout that's going together pretty super fast. And like I said before, that's the great thing about a grid layout. And I really like that Rachel uh, challenged us to get into our stash and use up some of those um, project life cards, right? Because I feel like we all have them or they come on cut apart sheets and we don't know what to do with them or they just end up not getting used or whatever the case might be. And so using them on your layouts is a really great way to use up some of those products. So I'm all about that these days because I'd really like to get some of that new Chamel Christmas magic <laughs> or how about some of that new Maggie Holmes line that's coming out from Crate Paper. But I absolutely refuse to buy any extra stuff other than my kits and until I have used up the stuff that I have and I've got a lot so my family just gave me some Alex drawers from Ikea for my birthday and I just got a brand new beautiful Gallant uh, desk that you can see me working on today from Ikea so I'm really excited about that so I've been reorganizing and trying to use up my stuff so that is what I'm all about these days getting her done like Nicole Jones says and get her done okay thanks so much for watching see you next time have an amazing day guys bye